It was the 23rd century, mankind's darkest hour. Fighting for so long, no one could remember the reason why it all started in the first place. All we knew is that there were two sides, the Coalition and the Alliance. For decades, millions died for the same piece of rock again and again. Finally, one side managed to gain the upper hand, the Coalition. The Alliance launched five sleeper ships. The hope was for them to begin again far from the war and strife that had befallen Earth, to start free from the prejudices that had divided us for so long. Each sleeper ship was christened after its patron nation. The Britonia, the Rhineland, the Hispania, the Casari, the Liberty. Colony ships broke through the Coalition blockade and headed for the Sirius system. That was 800 years ago, when we came here to rebuild our lives. We've come a long way since then. We have grown, we have prospered, we have flourished. But we will never forget. Hey everybody, this is Matthias here from Phoenix Gaming. I am very excited today to bring you guys Freelancer. This is one of my personal favorite games. The owner who made this, Chris Roberts, is actually currently working on Star Citizen currently, which is still in development. I also have a few videos of that game, which I'll be getting more out as more content is released. Right now we're here to talk about Freelancer. I'll be going to start my playthrough today. And like I said about all my other playthroughs, this is a playthrough. Not a walkthrough. So if you're expecting that, I'm sorry, look for other videos. I'm just here to have fun, and I'd like you guys to join with me. Without further ado, let's get started on this. Roger that. Call system show 
Green. SA-14, you're cleared for departure. Acknowledge Freeport 7. We'll see you in about two weeks. SA-14, we're picking up unknown contacts on long-range sensors. We're dispatching a fighter wing to escort you out of the system. Godspeed. President Jacoby has asked the LSF to investigate the sudden destruction of Freeport 7. No word yet on whether it was accidental or a deliberate attack. The first handful of survivors arrived on Manhattan this morning. <coughs> Medical. Is there anyone seriously injured? One. Inside. Make sure he lives. He owes me some credits. Your concern is touching. We'll do everything we can. It may take a while. Officially, the Liberty Security Force maintains there is no proof Freeport 7's destruction was deliberate. But sources inside the LSF say they suspect the dangerous criminal organization, The Order. We will keep you up to date as the story develops. So here we are, Planet Manhattan. So, we have to go look for a job in the bar. So we have the bar, commodity trader, equipment dealer, and ship dealer. We're currently located over at the launch pad. Let's get started. Sidewinder Fang. All we have is Liberty Ale, friend. Fine. Her name's Junko Zane. She's a tough one. Oh, well, why's that? She's LSF. All business. If it's a job you're wanting, that is. On the other hand, if you're looking for something more. Well, the only thing I'm looking for right now is this drink. I know you. No. No, I don't think so. The news. I saw your face on the news. You're one of the Freeport 7 survivors, aren't you? Yeah. I heard it was pretty bad out there. You know, you're lucky to be alive. Ha. Huh. This one's on me, friend. It's the good stuff. Why? Because it's not every day a man has the chance to start again, huh? To your good fortune and liberty, sir. Well, it can't get any worse. Thanks. <clears throat> All right then. So, let's go talk to Junko. Junko Zane. I understand what you're saying, but I don't have nearly enough people. Juni, the environment has changed. Well, with groups like the Order taking more and more liberties, indeed now threatening our profits, some in the government feel that we need to increase our patrols in these areas. <clears throat> you, Junko Zane? Yes? I believe you have business to discuss. Wait! 
I will leave this matter in your capable hands. Sorry. The bartender said you work for the Liberty Security Force. And who do you work for, Mr. Uh... Trent. I work for myself. What kind of ship do you have? I lost mine on Freeport 7. I see. Are you staying in Liberty long? I've got a friend who was injured in the attack. He's in medical. I'll be staying at least until he's released. Well, as it happens, I could use a good freelancer, Mr. Trent. I'll be in the equipment room later. You can meet me there. Oh, and if we are going to work together, call me Junie. <clears throat> All right, a quick overview of how we got around this area. So, in places like this, you're able to barter for information, get here the local gossip, and even missions, and local news. Let's see what this guy say real fast. Hello, help you? Anything for me? It's your first time here, isn't it? Uh huh. I see. I work for Deep Space Engineering. We may not own this place, but we do have a sizable stake in its operation. Well, if you must know, I have heard a rumor. Yeah? What's up? Okay, here's what's going on. See, a lot of these times, you won't really Good to know. ever Thanks. like get any That's useful great. information, but Good sometimes luck. it's some fun hidden plot. And sometimes with the guys who are doing the missions, you can even get, like, repeat missions from the same guy in your conversations get more deep. And by this, when you buy stuff, generally that's buying your reputation with certain factions in the game. But some factions, by increasing your factions with them, you actually lose faction power with another faction. And also you can gain, like, maps, or also... Like information, like where a hidden ship might be trashed, where some weapons or some cargo is there, which you can later go grab, use on your ship, or go sell it. So let's go see what they've got for us, the equipment dealer. Hello. to work for the LSF, Mr. Trent? It's just Trent. And yeah, I'm here to see what you have to offer. Well, I found this ship for you. It's very basic and you won't have jump access yet, but it should be good enough for now. This assignment will be easy. All you have to do is babysit a convoy of food and medical supplies. You'll be hooking up with the escort CEO King. I'll tell him to expect you. That is, of course, if you're interested. Oh, well, if we decline, if we ha can't get a ship, we can't get anything. So we better just accept it. Move on. Sounds good. I'm in. Good. Better get going. I'll have your ship moved immediately. All you'll have to do is go to the landing pad and launch. King will be waiting for you near the docking ring in space, okay? I'll see you when you get back. Thanks. One thing about... Uh, um, this game is its name, Freelancer. You can follow the main storyline, or you can deviate at any time. These missions aren't one right after another. In order to get to the next mission after you complete one, you actually have to gain a certain amount of net worth by completing other missions and selling goods, mining, all of that type of stuff, in order to get to the next level and the next mission. And by doing that, that's what will happen. Now, being said, I'm not going to deviate from the main storyline, I just want to get these out here for you guys, because I love the story of this game, I wish they made a second one, which in a way they did. They made a crossfire mod, but it's a lot more difficult than the base game. So maybe we'll get that mod out there later, but right now, let's get this game going. To space.
You must be Trent. I'm King, the CEO of this mission. I contacted the lead transport of the convoy. They've completed pre-launch checks and are ready to go. Should be an easy run from here to Fort Bush, and then on to Pittsburgh. Ready? It's good to meet you, King. Is that a Rhineland cruiser? That's the Donau, Admiral Schultz's flagship. He's visiting Manhattan to attend a high-level meeting with President Jacoby. Keep your distance. Newark Station, this is RNC Donau, requesting clearance to dock with your station. Over. Affirmative, Donau. You are cleared for docking point six. Liberty welcomes you and Admiral Schultzke. Donau, be advised, we're picking up unknown contacts. Advise caution. Understood, Newark. All escorts, power up weapons. Affirmative, ready to engage. Roger, tracking incoming ships. Unidentified ships, game. this is Newark Station. You are entering restricted space. Alter course at once or we will open fire. You have do not interfere. We're here to protect the president. Shulsky is a traitor. Red alert. The Donau is hit. Launch all rescue and defensive units. All other fighters engage enemy ships. All other ones open fire. No! Oh my god. They blew up the Donau! Newark, this is LSF Patrol Gamma 6, engaging enemy! Confirmed, Gamma 6. The oil will pay for this. That good wing, fire at will. Understood. Targeting all enemy ships. Trent, we can't let them get away. Engage the enemy! <laughs> Newark, we need reinforcements! Interceptors are en route. The Colorado and its escort are inbound. One thing I really love about this game is the fact that you can fly with your mouse. It's one of the most easiest to fly spacey games I've ever seen. And the graphics are just amazing. I think this one is starting to crack. And like in a lot of the games like this, as you can tell here, people will drop stuff. There's a few weapons, no cargo, escape pods, we read you. and Radar is clear. SAR, like report. weapon cargoes, survivors. shield batteries, Negative nanobots, We're continuing our a lot of sort of stuff. To all utility ships in the area, scan for survivors. All other vessels, return to normal duty, but stay alert. Trent, there's nothing more we can do here. The transports are waiting at Fort Bush. I've uploaded a waypoint to your neural net. Just fly toward it. Yeah, fly toward it. Uh, what could it be? I think I get better graphics about this. How did they get this close to Manhattan without being detected? Nope, that's not it. First three point seven. There we are. Okay. Four minutes. Oh, gosh, that's so detailed to maximum. Yes. And now this. Oh yeah, much better. It's getting out of control. If we're gonna play a game. We gotta have the best we can do. This is very simple how they did it, but the effects they have. All right, are we've reached amazing. the trade lane. Engaging activation sequence. Trent, you go first. Now, in comparison to Star Citizen, another one of Chris Roberts' game like this one, Duh. it's gonna be a lot of difference of space travel. Instead of having lanes like this, Lane you actually initiated. have to um. This is it, yeah, Trent. Drives and stuff. This is one of the major arteries through Manhattan space. We're only taking it as far as Fort Bush. If we kept going, we'd reach the jump gate to the Colorado system. Transport leader, this is LSF Patrol Gamma 6. We're here to escort you to Pittsburgh. Over. Roger, Gamma 6. This is the USV Brandt. Pre-launch checks have been completed. Trent, take up a position near the transport. Use the formation maneuver to link up with the convoy. Check. Already this is there. transport leader. All ships are in position and we show green status. We heard the news about Schultzky. What happened? The planetary defense grid was offline and the order managed to break through. They took out the Donau with their first missile salvo. 
we never had a chance to stop them. Looked like the Order was determined to keep Shulsky from meeting the President. Hard to believe that this could happen. We better get going. Let's hope for the best. Several convoys have come under attack in recent weeks. The rogue problem has gotten out of control in this area. Don't worry. That's why we're here. Activation sequence completed. Lane jump initiated. Now, downside with stuff like this, with the trade lanes, they can be disabled. And if they're disabled, Looking you're no longer so able far. to go as fast as you need to. Alert! Trade lane Observe. disruption detected. Formation cross. Damn it! Trent, get your weapons ready! This could get rough! The there! Rogues! Trent, break an attack! We've got to keep them away until the trade lane comes back up! Rogues are fun. I prefer fighting, uh... What was it? Uh, flankers. Flankers. Or the scavengers. One of the two. Maybe I have a name wrong. I'll see them later. But, uh, they have some better weapon drops I've seen in the game. Rogues have a... A semi-medium firing weapon, but pretty good damage. The Outcast. The Outcast have really slow fire weapons. So can, like, run. You'll notice here that we have armor and shields. Shields can regenerate over time, armor cannot. We have shield batteries and nanobots. Shield batteries will increase how much your shield power responds, and your nanobots will repair your hull. But if you lose a weapon, Weapons you can't get it back. It's gone. Last one. We better get out of here before more of them show up. Formation. Couldn't agree more. The trade lane is back. Right up. here, in the bottom. Wait. We have. We have new targets. Get the six. We have to make a move for it. Jill status. This is gonna be Parallel. close, but I think we can make By it without Parallel. another fight. Kind of same Everybody stay team. on course. Trent, do well, not right now, engage the weapons. pirates. We have to get the convoy out of here. And my weapons power isn't too big effective, to be honest. But if I had like slower refined weapons I pirate that had a huge punch on them or a lot of weapons, that would be drained. I wouldn't be able to just to fire indiscriminately. I'd have to fire in bursts and actually aim where I'm going. So, keep that in mind. We made it! Everybody in one piece? Fairly. That was close. Thanks for getting us here in one piece, Gamma 6. We almost didn't make it. A situation we're soon to fix. The rogues were better equipped than we expected, but we got what we came for. Thanks for playing the bait. Now it's your turn to reel him in, King. We're gonna unload our cargo. Remember our bargain. I'm transferring the payment to your neural net account. Understood. Transport leader out. Hey, King. What's going on? You'll see soon enough. Go ahead and land on Pittsburgh. I'll meet you on the surface. Now, also different in some space games, this, the docking ring, basically allows you to the atmosphere. All the bigger ships have to. We're up there. We'll take shuttles down to the planet. Acknowledged. Your request to land is granted. Proceed to land. You'll find Pittsburgh to be remarkably unexciting, Trent. That's the mining operation. Not much to look at. A lot of rocks, smoke, and fire. But what it lacks in class, it more than makes up for in cheap drinks. Set your ship down on one of the landing pads over there. Credits. Hey, King. Did you know it was gonna get hot out there? Mm hmm. We're not done yet. 
We're just waiting for the others. What others? We've suspected for some time now that the Order has had ties to organized crime and liberty. They may even be hiding a secret base. I think we're on to something here, and I've called for backup. We could really use you out there, Trent. All right, but this had better be worth it. It will be. I promise you. Oh, and, uh, Trent, now that you have a little scratch, I'm looking to outfitting that pile of junk you're flying. Try the equipment dealer over there. He always has good deals. I'll see you in space. Now, a quick explanation for you guys right now before I move on. So, right now I'm playing the full mission and showing it all in this video. In future videos to come, when I have a weapons, unless it's something really cool, I will not be really showing it. I'll be getting in and out so you guys can see the missions, the storyline, and you guys don't have to watch me fly around. I'll try cutting in bits and pieces where I have miniature encounters so you guys can see, like, the combat aspect, and just see the action bits. But I'm also going to explain a few things here. So let's head over to the commodity trailer before we go to our ship. I know we believe we picked up some scrap metal. Construction machinery. I'm going to sell that. Now down here, it's going to show us like places where we can buy it and sell it, and it'll show us the different costs. This is used for like the trade aspect in the game. For example, if I was to buy a boron here for 120, I could take it to Plant Manhattan and sell it for 35 more. That's not like the best thing, considering I can only hold 20. That's not a very big of a game. It's only a couple hundred. Now, let's head over to the equipment dealer. This is the, the primary we'll be doing here. So currently I've got two Justice Marks 1s. We've got 16 hull damage per shot and 8 shield damage. But also, each weapon does different amounts of damage to different types of shields. This is most effective against Pauldron shields, and weakest against Graviton shields. So what we've got here, we have this planet's version of Star Beams. They use, they both use about the same amount of, re just a little bit more energy, and the Advanced Star Beam actually shoots a little bit more damage than the Justice ones. So that's the best. I can get some missiles. You know what? Let's get some missiles. The reason why these... You'll notice there's like three different missiles and different costs. Let's see if I can tell the difference. The Stalker missile goes a lot faster. But shoots slower and turns a lot faster. I'm going go with the Javelin. It's pretty standard. I'm going to go in and sell these two Justice Mark ones. And get the advanced star beams because they have a little damage. We'll need all the help we can get. It comes with 10 javelin missiles. I'm probably able to find more later. So we're just gonna grab an extra 10. Loaded into cargo hold. Shields. Fortunately, I don't have enough money to upgrade to the advanced, so currently I'm just using the standard. Which basically gives me more shield power. Now these are what we're talking about nanobots and shield batteries. The nanobots basically repair 600 shield units. Um, let me rephrase that, not shield units, hull units. Well, the shield is 300 to the shields. So now that's all taken care of. Let's go look, just for fun, at what this plant has to offer for ships. This is the early, early version of a trader. It has a lot of weapon ports, and in this one, you can actually have turrets. Turrets can go like generally like 180 degrees. Well, 360 degrees around your ship, but it'll only be 100 from its point flush to the ship. Really great if you ran away trying to get a flank on somebody. I've seen even some of these that are just outfitted with missiles. They're cool, but unfortunately, the missiles can be stopped shot down, and you run out very fast. So without further ado, let's get back into space and finish this mission up for you guys. You guys will even notice it's slightly different the wait list on my ship.
Now, with this is like mission briefing, I've got to tell you guys about it earlier. It will give you a basic map of where you are and where you're going to be going. Sometimes you will have to leave the system you're in. Right now, we're staying in New York. There you are. Four LSF wings from Fort Bush are searching the debris field for the rogue base. They've already taken prisoners. I'm uploading the coordinates for our search pattern. We'll rendezvous with another wing of fighters for our patrol. Hold on, there they are. Gamma 6, Delta Patrol reports no hostile contacts. Tell them to keep looking. One way or another, we'll find where those rogues are hiding. Let's go look around, because now that we're in formation, we're going to follow them. Now, like I said earlier, there are some parts of the game After where the I will do my best transport, the LSF to skip over the guys. Wings to help us track down as you can tell, here, they have a lot of information to share they with us. Have a secret base around here, and this time, we'll find it. Mayday, Mayday! This is Prison Ship XC-19. We're under attack. To all Liberty Patrols, please respond! All units, change course to intercept. I'm uploading a waypoint. This is LSF Patrol Gamma 6. We're on an intercept course and are approaching your position. Over. Acknowledge Gamma 6. We're under attack by multiple rogue fighters. We have fires on several decks and our defenses are failing. Understood. Hang on. Alright. So I can... Some of the longer missions later on, because this mission, actually, believe it or not, is a kind of shorter one. This is the starter mission. You'll have a lot of time where I'll just be flying around and even doing side missions. So just for right now, you, I'm showing this all. We're Later on, heavy we'll get to the rest. Alright. There she is. She's hurt bad. Everyone, break formation and engage. I've got a target. Roger that. Now if I remember how to use the missiles, we need you. There we go. The count. Don't want to hit the prison ship. Oop. I collided with him. Stay away from the ship. Stay away from the ship. Alert! We're picking up several new hostile contacts. Damn it! More pirates! Trent, defend the prison ship at all costs! Normally I avoid using missiles, but it's always good to showcase a little more what we got going on here. I could have outfitted another weapon. Later, what I quite often like doing is the case done pulse turn onto one of my later ships. What that does is it rips right through the shields you know, these guys. Yeah, that was the last one. The radar is clear. Do we get XT-19. What is your status? Over. Fires are contained. We lost life support to several decks, but we're all right. Over. See how the damage is Acknowledged. Here. Is there any way we can assist you? Negative. Repair crews from Pittsburgh are on the way. You came just in time. Glad we could help. Epsilon Wing, stay here in case more rogues show up. Trent and I will continue the search on our own. Affirmative. Good luck. I'm uploading new coordinates. Trent, take the lead. Go to. You'll notice he's not information with me. Sometimes just for fun, I'll just do this, see what he does. It's kind of fun. It's good. When you now, when you are in like 
the go to the mode, base must be around here. it will automatically never catch attack your attack something as big as a prison button. ship too far away from their hideout. Alright, if I point directly at the main debris, it will do its best to avoid it. Now, if I suddenly fly right at it, of course, I'm going to hit it. See? Mayday! This is LSF Beta 4! I'm under attack and need assistance! This is LSF Patrol Gamma 6! We hear you, Beta 4! Where are you? Over! Alright, Trent, let's take these guys right, out. Let's take them out. Also, is that if you guys remember from earlier in the store, there was also two other items that I didn't purchase. One was mines, which basically is something that you can drop behind your ship and peek onto other enemy vessels. The other one is countermeasure droppers, which are basically just like I use missiles, the enemy can use missiles against me. So I would need to find like have my players to stop them. Later on, there are torpedoes, like taking out capital ships with a lot of heavy damage. Beta 4, what is your status? The ship is holding together! Barely! Where's the rest of your wing? Gone! We were sweeping through the debris field and ran into heavy fire inside a dense particle cloud. That's it! You must have been close to their base! Can you show us where you were? I'm uploading the coordinates now! My systems are fried, and I have a coolant leak! I'm headed back to Pittsburgh. Good luck, Beta 4. Thanks. To you as well. Let's go. Head to the coordinates. Alright, let's go. This is the Trent, final bit. I think this is it. I'm gonna call in for some backup. To all units, this is Gamma 6. We have a potential location of the rogue base. Converge on the following coordinates. This is Alpha 1. Acknowledged. We'll rendezvous at the coordinates. Over. This is Delta-1 Leader. We're on the far side of Pittsburgh. Changing course to your location. Over. Wait. I've got something. Incoming rogue fighters. Get ready. Trent, I read no more hostiles. He's trying to run. They're fleeing into the field. Gamma-6, this is LSF Alpha-1. What's your status? The rogue base must be in the cloud ahead. Trent, take the lead. Understood. They like saying that a lot. They like, they like saying, take the lead. So what do we got here? There! The rogue base! To all uh, units, this is Gamma 6. We've confirmed the location of the rogue base. I'm transmitting new coordinates. Where is it? I don't see it. Ah, there it is. All units, Ooh. I can make out two defense platforms and an armored depot. We'll need torpedoes to take it out. Over. Delta Wing is carrying torpedoes. They're on their way, Trent. We can't take out the base, their armor is too strong, but we can soften up their defenses by taking out the platforms. Let's go. I'm working on it. One to go. Trent, look out, more pirate ships closing in fast. I hope those reinforcements get here soon. Second platform is down. Where are these torpedo bombers? This is LSF Delta-1. We're making our torpedo run at the station. Over. Good to see you guys. Let's finish them off. Remember what I said about torpedoes earlier? Well, let's see what we can see them in action. Torpedoes away. Great shot, Delta Leader. Our pleasure, Gamma 6. We couldn't have done it without you. Remaining fighters, Trent. We can't let them get away. I 
with the rest of them. Gamma 6, we've got it from here. All units, secure the area. Good work, Trent. Let's get clear. I'm uploading coordinates for Pittsburgh to your neural net. Let's go. So there's a little bit of story left, I believe, in this mission, and then we'll be closing it out here. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys will watch the rest of this trick. series. Not bad for a rookie. Something tells me I'm going to be seeing a lot more of you in the future. What we did here today will hopefully put a dent in the growing crime problem we've been having in this system. Maybe now we can focus our full attention on the Order and anyone who supports them. Schultzky's assassination can't go unpunished. Trent, Junie just sent me a message on the secure channel. Change of plans. I need to divert. Look, if you land on Pittsburgh, talk to one of the deep space reps. They'll have something lined up for you. Meanwhile, I'm transferring your payment now. Thanks for your help. See you around. All right, that's Trent, that. this is Judy. Good job. King just told me how impressed he was with you. Hope this wasn't too much for your first assignment. I wanted to meet up with you, but the attack on Schultzky has everyone rattled. President Jacoby's ordered a full investigation to determine what can be done about the order. It'll likely mean more work for us soon. Meanwhile, why don't you spread your wings a bit? Familiarize yourself with the New York system. Maybe see what work you can pick up. I'll be in touch. Judy out. Alright, so I'm actually going to end the video here, but first I'm going to take out one other thing. This is our current status. We're currently level 2, and our current worth is 13,396. This is where we get off. Before we can start the next mission, we need to earn enough money to get to 16... Oh, I need to move. Let me run over. Okay, where was I? Okay, before we can level up to the next mission, to the next campaign mission, we need to get up to this level. So we need to gain just over $3,000. Hey, and we do that by doing missions. It also shows all of our stats, how much we killed, where we visited, how many systems, and the jump holes we found, which are essentially like rips in space where we can basically slip through to another system. Where there's a lot of them around. Now over here we have Reputation. As you can tell, we were fighting Liberty Rogues, so we're very hostile with them. But by attacking them, we're now friends with all these people. Now, if I was to start attacking, if I was to start attacking all these people, I would suddenly start getting a lot better rep with these guys. Junkers, they're the guys I enjoy fighting the most, mainly because I love their weapons. But until next time, this is Matthias from Four signing out. Remember to like Dog and subscribe. Your request to land is granted. Proceed to 